What's good everybody? It's your girl Cherry and welcome back to Life of Chevy Vlogs. So Cherry Blossoms, I am here today with some content that is kind of familiar to y'all but it's slightly a little bit different. So y'all know I love go doing my grocery hauls. I love getting out and about, going to Walmart, out to out, getting everything I can get my hands on and so on for it. But because I'm still recovering from my C-section and baby boy... Myla and Dwayne are on the side. I told them, like, I got to get back into the habit or the flow of recording. So, you know, bear with me. But um, because I am recovering from my C-section still, I just felt like I wasn't up to going out to the stores, being on my feet, and doing so on for it. Dwayne is a big fan of ordering from Instacart. And Instacart is basically where you could order your groceries. It's more than groceries you will order, right? Or it's groceries. You can order groceries, medication. And by the way, yes, yes. Your girl, this is real life. Your girl got dishes. Don't judge me. Go judge your mama, okay? But no, on Instacart, you can order things like groceries, medicine. Um, they have wine that you can order. They have like just a array of different things that you can order through the app. And someone will go shopping for you and bring it to your door. So I tried something a little different. And I did a Instacart order. At first, it was a mess. The first supermarket I chose and I ordered from, um, they never got my order. So we were waiting hours and the order was never received. So I had to call customer service, cancel the order, pick a different supermarket. All It was just a mess. It was a mess. But long and behold, here we are. Your girl has a grocery haul for y'all today. Your girl has a grocery haul for y'all today. And this is all of the stuff that I ordered from the app Instacart and yeah we're gonna get into everything but before I go through each item of what I got if you are new here hey boo hey my name is Cherry and my channel is all about you know just following me as I survive these New York streets no being a mom of two now two being a mom you know it's crazy for me to say that being a mom of two like I don't know like just <laughs> I'm a mom of two yeah, but it's, it's a little weird for me to say being a mama too, like, but yes, um, my channel is all about me just being a mama too, um, decorating my home and just living my day-to-day -day life. So if you are interested in content like that, then be sure to give this video a big thumbs up, become a part of the family by hitting that subscribe button, and of course, turn on your post notifications so you'll know the next time I post a new video. All right, so let's get into this massive app ordering grocery haul or whatever the case may be that I did. And before I start, let me just tell y'all that as always, um, I like to pick out my meats and my vegetables myself. So don't come for me and be like, where's your fruits at, sis? Where's your veggies at? Because we will go to our local supermarket and just pick out our fruits and vegetables and things like that. But this is just like basically some of the other things that we needed in the house. So let's get right into this grocery haul. So here's everything. Let's start over here. So right here, um, Myla and Dwayne chose the cereal. Myla chose, uh, I think she chose the Apple Jacks. No, she chose the Fruit Loops and Dwayne chose the Apple Jacks. I'm a simple type of cereal person. You know, I could eat Cheerios. I could eat Kicks. I could eat honey bunches of oats and be satisfied with my cereal. They more of like the the sugary cereal type of people. But yeah, this is what they chose. I got this 18 bag of chip mix. It come with all of these flavors right here. Um, so this is grab and go. Myla could pack them for her snack at school and things like that. I got one of these large... Prego meat flavored um, pasta sauces. I thought I had ordered two of these, but I only got one, but it's okay. I'm going to check my order later to see if I did put two in there or not. So then over here, we have, over here I have two things of Poland Spring water. I have these ready and grilled um, chicken breasts. And I use these for my salads, for if I'm making quesadillas, for quick and easy dinners. Like these always come in handy for nights when you don't feel like cooking, but you got to feed the family. So I got that. I got this big bag of brown and serve sausages. Um, I have two of my ground turkeys here. I use this for spaghetti. I use this for, um, what else are you making with ground turkey? Oh, I use it for tacos. Thank you. I use it for spaghetti, tacos, um, you know, things like that. 
over here back here and by the way these flowers i am still loving these flowers someone came to visit me and they brought me these flowers you know as a present for having a baby <laughs> and they are just so look at the color it's just so vibrant it's just so i just love them and it's not even like very full or anything like that but the color is just it's just beautiful it's beautiful but anywho so yeah until they die you will be seeing these flowers making an appearance in every video all right so back here i got some beans some bushes baked beans we just be eating this like if we make rice sometimes we might throw in a can of these type of beans and so on for it i got some green cut string beans and i thought i had another okay here's the other one i must say i thought i had two of these so here's the other string beans i got so i have two string beans um i have some red kidney beans i like when i make white rice and the red kidney beans it tastes really good together i got a couple of spaghetti and meatballs and raviolis for myla something quick and easy for maybe like lunch spring break is coming up so i gotta get a lot of you know things that i can make very simply for her when she's home also i got some of these pineapples and 100 percent juice as well as the mandarin oranges and 100 percent juice i got some jasmine rice i got some um grape jelly i got some grape jelly i got some um sweet relish let me tell y'all something about Dwayne. Dwayne, who's walking away he has been holding out on me who knew that he knew how to make um egg salad and one day he was like, here, I made an egg salad sandwich. You want some? And I'm like, wait a minute. I've known you all these years and you never made an egg salad sandwich for me. So I had to make sure we get the relish because your girl need egg salad sandwiches once a week. I got more secrets too. <laughs> he got more secrets. He just don't like to cook. But yeah, so that's why I got the relish. So he can make me some egg salad sandwiches. I got one box of um macaroni. I got some breadsticks for when we do make spaghetti. I have some of these sausages. I usually get the turkey sausages, but they were sold out. So the shopper replaced them for these right here, which I'm okay with. I got some yogurt for Myla. I'm not sure if I mentioned this, but I got some apple juices. Myla has been filling the apple juice more than the Kool-Aid jammers. So this is what she's been drinking. I got two different boxes of Goya rice, broccoli and cheddar, and rice and pigeon peas. And baby boy, you want me to get that for you? Uh, and baby boy is not happy over there, but dad has them. So I got these two. Normally I don't get these flavor rices, but this is all they had in the app. So I just end up getting these two. Um, Dwayne wants me to make him a lemon cake. So he got this. We'll make a cake. I got some honey wheat bread, some everything bagels, some olive oil. And I don't know what it is, but lately I have been craving beef patties. So I picked up a box of these beef patties and I don't know, it must be a Bronx thing. Your girl been wanting a beef patty with cheese. So tomorrow I think I'm going to have me a beef patty with cheese, okay? I got some of these strawberry apple sauces. I usually get mango, but they didn't have mango. So the shopper replaced it for strawberry. I okayed it. So that's how we end up with strawberry. Um, Back here. We have two of these silk milks. Y'all know we go through milk crazy fast in here. We could drink one of these a day. So, like, legit, we be needing, like, four or five milks in, in the refrigerator at one time. Um, I got an orange juice here. Dwayne wanted this Lipton tea mix. He said that it's more cost-efficient, which, let me tell y'all, I do agree with him. It's more cost-efficient to buy a big thing of, like, juice mix and just make pictures of juice Versus every day having to go out and spend $5, $4 on a jar of juice and then it's gone. So he's in charge of making iced tea because I normally just buy, the, buy a container of juice and put it in the refrigerator. So I could just open it and drink it and that's that. Let me know in the comments down below. Do y'all prefer to buy juices like that's already made? Or do y'all like to get the powdered version and make y'all own juices? Y'all can add as much water, sugar, or whatever y'all want into it. So let me know down below. All right, so now I have, um, I got a Schweppes ginger ale, which I love my ginger ale with ice, so I will definitely be putting that in the freezer, let it get a little slush, and y'all know, if y'all drink soda, and mind you, this is the only soda I drink, if y'all drink soda, that first sip with that acid, oh, it's life, it is life, so I got that, um, 
Here we got some double stuffed Oreos. I was trying to find the little individual packs so Myla could take it to school for a snack, but they didn't have it. So I just got this and then I'll put probably like four a piece in a Ziploc bag and let her take it like that. Then I have some Swiss rolls. I'm just trying to change up the snacks here because we usually get the same snacks. Dwayne is always complaining that me and Myla are kind of boring with our taste buds. We always get the same thing over and over again. So boom, how you like me now? I got the Swiss rolls. <laughs> then, then I got some um, cosmic brownies. Um, I'm not that big of a chocolate fan, but these brownies, they taste pretty okay. I'll only eat them if I put them in a microwave and it gets like a little soft and gooey. So I got those as well. I got one thing of um, pasta because we still have spaghetti. We still have macaroni noodles. Like we have all the other noodles except for this one. So I got that. I have a creamy Caesar dressing here. And my favorite salad dressing is Ken's, but for some reason, this supermarket did not have Ken's at all. So I just got Wishbone, and I got a creamy Italian dressing as well. I love making salads. Normally, I would get a big thing of spinach, but I prefer to pick out my own spinach as well. So when I do my fruits and vegetable haul, um, my fruits and vegetable shopping, then I'll get that. I got these Southern Home Style Biscuits. Are these the same exact ones? Yes, I got two of these. Oh, yeah, and let me know in the comments below, would y'all like to see a haul of me once I go and do my fruits and vegetable shopping? So I'm going to pick up a couple meats, fruits, and vegetables, and usually when I do that portion, I just buy it and put it in my refrigerator. I never come back and update y'all, but let me know down in the comments below if y'all would like to see a separate video of me with just my fruits and vegetables. All right, so I also have taco shells here, just regular, and then the nacho cheddar ones. And then over here, did I show y'all this? I don't think so. I have these Eggos. This is a, a mistake. This has to be a mistake. Because there's no reason that I will order 24, the 24 pack of this, and then turn around and order the 10 pack of that. Like, it's unnecessary. But I said, you know what? For the rest of this week, we will be eating Minnie's Cinnamon Toast, okay? So I got the Cinnamon Toast Eggos, and then I got the Buttermilk Waffles, and then I have this one right here as well so this is everything that I got from ordering from the app um, I think the shopper did a really good job of getting everything that I asked for I definitely have to recheck to see if I was supposed to get another one of these sources which I really think I was but yeah here is my grocery haul and I hope you guys enjoy oh and I always say out a price so let me know how much y'all think this is. Take a minute right now. I'm going to give y'all a second to guess how much you think all of this stuff cost. Now that I'm looking at everything, I'm like, yo, this stuff was kind of expensive. So my total was like $309 for all of this stuff. And I feel like. Your girl, spent, your girl spent a lot of money. Your girl spent a lot of money. But it did remove me having to physically go out and do the shopping. Baby boy is only three weeks. And we really not trying to have him outside like that. So this, I guess, is a good substitute if you're injured or you can't make it outside. Or if you're like me with a newborn recovering from a C-section. So um, overall, I'll say my experience grocery shopping through an app was okay. I would do it again if I had to, but personally, I still prefer like foot to the pavement, getting out there and grabbing everything that I need to get on my own. But anyways, you guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope y'all enjoyed this grocery haul, you, although, you know, it's a little different than I normally do it. Sooner than later, your girl will be back out there shopping in the stores, up and down the aisles like I normally am. Baby boy's a little fussy, so it's time. It's time to end this video, okay? Please be sure to give this video a big thumbs up. Please be sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on your post notifications so you'll know the next time I post a new video. I love y'all for watching. I'll see you in my next video, Blossoms. Bye. What you mad at, Mr. Man?
Mr. Man not happy. He not happy. Yes, are you looking at me? Hi, my boy. Hi, mama, baby. How'd you do it? Say hi, mama. Hi, mama. How'd you do it? All right, guys. So it is now the next day, and I just want to show y'all really quickly. We did go to the supermarket. Well, actually, Dwayne went to the supermarket, and he picked up a couple of um, fruits and vegetables. I like my fruits and vegetables fat, fresh, so I prefer to get them as they're needed versus just having an overstock of it in a house, and it goes bad. I used to buy fruits and vegetables in bulk, and then some of it we never got to, so we just end up wasting it. So um, tonight, we're going to have a spinach salad. So... The Wayne did pick up a spinach. We have baby spinach here. And this is the bigger one of the baby spinach. So we have two of those. We have some croutons here. We have some lemons for the um, iced tea that the Wayne's going to be making. And that's why we have this water here as well. Because we use um, bottled water to make our iced tea, not water from the faucet. We have a cantaloupe. We have a red onion that's going to be going in the salad. We have cucumbers, um, this right here, beet juice. I started drinking this beet juice um, right after I had the baby and I had my C-section. And it's something that I kind of just got in a habit of doing every day. Beet juice has amazing health benefits. And my doula told me it was great for speeding up the process um, of my C-section and just like helping my um, uterus shrink back down to size and things like that. So we got some beet juice, and then we have some oranges here as well. So yeah, y'all, we do be getting fruits and vegetables, okay? And I will say, honestly, ordering from the app versus going to the store, it is more costly. And I can't wait until I'm able to get back out and about and just do my grocery shopping myself. Because there's a lot of things I didn't get. Like, I usually get cups and plates and some cleaning supplies and things like that. And then my total will be about $300. But just on the groceries y'all saw in the previous clip, just that stuff was $300. This stuff today was about, I don't know, like $40-ish. And yeah, so that's what we have here. 